different water resources in india learning objectives understand importance of water identify water sources explore natural sources examine human made sources study use of ground water learn water conservation address water pollution start up today you are going to learn about the different water resources rivers are a natural source of fresh water that flows from mountains and glaciers dams are artificial sources of water to store water and generate electricity we must conserve water as the population grows and rainfall decreases to ensure that everyone gets clean water water is essential for a life we use it for cooking drinking bathing agriculture and generating electricity both plants and animals need water to live and grow about 70% of the earth's surface is covered by water sources of water there are two sources of water natural resources and artificial resources natural sources include rivers lakes seas and oceans artificial sources include dams wells and tanks natural sources of water rain is a primary source of fresh water on earth water flows into streams rivers lakes and ponds rivers like the ganga brahmaputra and indus are fed by melting snow from mountains and glaciers while others like narmada godavari and krishna depend on rains lakes are bodies of water they do not flow like rivers they are surrounded by land some famous lakes in india include the sambar lake vular lake chilka lake powai lake and the palikat lake ground water is a rain water that goes into the ground farmers use it for irrigation and crop growth by using pumps and tube wells a decrease in rainfall reduces the crop production human made sources of water artificial sources of water include wells dams canals and reservoirs wells and canals are used for irrigation dams and reservoirs stores water wells in rural areas are important sources of water sometimes the underground water is too deep to take out then farmers use borehills and machines to get it farmers dig canals to transport river water to their fields in india there are dams on some rivers to create a reservoir at some dams they produce hydroelectricity also the water is used for irrigation dams also prevent floods by holding excess rain water do you know indira gandhi canal in rajasthan is the longest canal in india conservation of water you know human population is increasing the rainfall is not regular or dependable ground water is decreasing so there is an urgent need to conserve water to preserve rain water people are collecting and reusing runoff water in india we have rain water harvesting methods like step wells or bowlies but our actions contribute to water pollution we cannot drink polluted water we should use water wisely and maintain clean water sources even though water covers 3/4 of the earth's surface we have little water available for our use we must conserve water and do rainwater harvesting do you know india has the third largest number of dams in the world mind map different water resources in india importance of water essential for life used for many purposes sources of water natural sources of water rain rivers example ganga brahmaputra indus lakes example sambar vular chilka ground water human made sources are wells and boreholes dams and reservoirs and canals conservation of water collect and reuse rain water traditional rain water harvesting example bowlies step wells use water wisely maintain clean water sources chapter at a glance water is vital for life we use it for drinking cooking bathing agriculture and producing electricity sources of water are natural like rivers lakes seas and oceans 
are artificial like dams, wells and tanks. Rain is the main source of fresh water to fill rivers, lakes and to ensure groundwater. Groundwater is crucial for irrigation. Any decrease in rainfall affects the yield. Artificial water sources include wells and canals for irrigation as well as dams and reservoirs for storage and for producing electricity. In India, we have rainwater harvesting methods like step wells or bowlies are employed to conserve water. Human actions contribute to water pollution, so we should maintain clean water sources. As the population increases and groundwater decreases, there is an urgent need to conserve water and use it wisely.